Hey guys, it's Jen Cassetta, your nutritionist from Being Fat Sucks. Hey guys, it's Jen Cassetta, your eBoost trainer. I'm here with Jen Cassetta, who is a stiletto and self-defense class expert. Drop your center of gravity. Oh, my center of yeah. gravity. Yeah. Yeah. That is the most. I'm not kicking you in the balls. The for I <laughs> <laughs> you can. Hear me roar. How to defend your mind, body, and heart against people who suck. I was grabbed on the street very late at night. He grabbed me from behind, and in that half a second, like I knew in my head from my training that I had like an instant to choose whether to be a victim or a victor. A one in five women in the US will be the victim of a sexual assault. Crazy. Wow. Um, yeah. And one in four college age women. So it's even worse if you're younger. If you are feeling vulnerable or scared when you're walking to those parking lots or down the street, you give off nonverbal signs to would be attackers. So if you're walking kind of slouched down, scared, or distracted on your cell phones, which is everyone, yes, you will look like a giant target. Really fake it till you make it, stand up straight, look people in the eye. If you do find yourself in a very scary situation where maybe you're in a car, you're in a date rape situation where you've been thrown onto a couch or a bed and someone's coming in for the choke, first thing you wanna do here is drop your chin to your chest. That way it opens the trachea just a bit so you'll have a few more seconds to breathe. Ah. And I wanna soften up this grip. I can jab this right up into oh, right armpit. Into it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. I don't like to carry much in my little purse. Mm -hmm. So how can I defend myself? You still can. So if you're Attacker is coming up from behind you, he's gonna grab you, and you're gonna start screaming, bloody murder, yes, cursing, right? So he's probably gonna come here to try and block you. Yes. So you have to bite down. Ah. I'm gonna look for three targets, eyes, throat, and groin, and find out which is closest and most accessible. I could also kick, if I want to, up. Stop! Oh. Right foot. Or I'm gonna turn into him and just Boom, right across the face, and then take the heel and take him down right in the knee joint. And then I'm gonna elbow. knee him. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. he's nice. And then I'm gonna hit him on the back. <laughs> yeah, girl. And then finish, boom. Hey guys, have you been working really hard lately? Do you get sugar cravings, headaches in the afternoon? How about fatigue just all day long? One of the most common questions I get is what should I eat after a workout? I recommend you drink half of your body weight in ounces every single day. Because we have to fuel her for seven events. If we make the wrong decisions, we can really Man, weigh her sorry. down. Jennifer is just, she's just so smart. She knows everything about nutrition. Ready, here we go. Hands down to the floor, jump the feet out, draw the stomach in, and all the way up. I'm Jen Cassetta, your eBoost trainer. Have a great day.